Hi everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you are all doing well today. So today we are actually going to make some of these uh, strips, um, like collage strips. Uh, I saw Gail do these over on her channel and she got the inspiration from Tim Holtz and the new um, line that he has out which are actually wider than the normal ones he's done in the past. So this right here is one of my prototypes and there is the other one so we are going to make some of those and we are actually going to make them out of this roll of tape that actually or paper that actually goes into some type of calculator or something you can see the patina on there i actually got this from, I think, a thrift store like three or four years ago. It's just been sitting here. I had never opened it. So, and you can see the discoloration on the first pages. Um, so, I just cut these down to the same size that Gail did. So, they're um, eight tall and three wide. And then I went into my um, stash of authentic black and white photos here and picked out some here. And went ahead and cut them down to th around three inches wide so that they would fit and yeah so i thought these some of these would be fun to use on here this one's going the other way so i'm not sure about that one but we shall see let's go ahead and pick out a photo for our first one i really like this one somebody's wedding i am like obsessed with black and white photos um, so that is what we are going to be making today. And I just got out, this right here is Amnity Bloom. And these were just some off cuts uh, and different things that I had. I have some music sheet. And down here we have some more papers. Um, antique book page and stuff. So let's go ahead and get out a couple of these because I did not do that. And a various colors and styles. Yeah, just some different papers to use here. I hope you guys are all doing well today. Well, that's got a pretty color on it. So let's get one of those out. And that should be plenty. But yeah, I hope you guys are all doing well today. It is 5.44 a.m., guys, on... Let's see, what is today? Wednesday. I, um, I am working today. Look at that. I think that's going to be, like, perfect. Let me grab my tear roller. It'll be perfect for a spot somewhere. Um, yeah, I am working today 8 to 4, so, um, my husband's already off to work, so I figured I had a little bit of time to... Um, play and do a video before getting ready for work. I have to leave here about, I don't know, a little bit after um, around 7.15 or so. Oh, let's see. Okay, so we're using that picture. Now that's cute. So maybe that'll look good at the bottom. So let's go ahead and get our little cutter here. And just go ahead and cut this down to three inches. Just a little scrap there. So I think we'll put that at the bottom. There we go. Bring this on down. And we have our photo. That looks like I need to take just a little bit more off. And I think I used my Tim Holtz deckle edge, so let me grab that. And I did have some other strips, too, that I wanted to show you guys. Yep, that's definitely what you used. And I did distress this, so let me just give that a little something-something. Um, yeah, I'll sh show you guys another... Um, thing that I had out it has probably been in my folder in my stash I think I went that up farther 
And maybe we'll do this here. And then do our picture there. Yeah, that'll be cute. And now we need something at the top. Um, yeah, that has been in my folder forever and haven't used it. Oh, look, that's like perfect, right? Is that going to work perfect? Yeah. So let's go ahead and do, just do this one at three. Um, yeah, and never actually, you know, got around to the project, so... Then I think this one will go up there that way. I'm going to put that on top. I think that's going to work. Let's see. Let's make sure. Because I want them all to overlap just a little bit. Because that kind of keeps it from bending. Yeah, I think that'll be good. Hopefully. If not, we can find something to stick at the top of it. Go ahead and distress these pieces since I distressed the photo. Um, but yeah, there was kind of like um, film strips, and I never actually did the project. Um, I think I know who some of the strips are from, but not all of them, because I did find one paper in there, but I don't think all of it is theirs. So, all right. So I think I'm just going to use the art glitter glue. For this but yeah i hope you're all doing well today so like i said i'm working eight to four and off tomorrow I finally remembered to make me an appointment to get my nails done tomorrow so i'm excited about that they are just way too long and totally getting on my nerves right now so i Made that appointment going in the morning at 9.30 um, to do that. Still supposed to be in weather-wise sunny today. That's a little bit over, but we can always cut that. I don't think I exactly got that straight either, but, you know, whatever. And that... I'll go there, or we'll go there. Yeah, I think that'll work out. I'm just going to use the glue stick on there. Um, But yeah, off tomorrow, so I'm going to get my nails done tomorrow. They need to be cut way down because they're seriously, like, getting on my nerves, and they kind of hurt. A little bit they are so tall who are these people taken by the church on Phyllis's wedding huh nice so love these old photos kind of you know one of my obsessions oh, shucks and I have many man all over my mat All right, let me grab a wet one. I must have known I was going to do that. I had these right beside me. I should have cleaned my mat. It's getting so dirty. I had some stuff out here that was vintage. See, that's not really wanting to stick down great. This part just feels so thin. See that? But I think it would be okay. So this could be used as a belly band or a side tuck. I think, I don't know. Maybe I should strengthen that up on the back. Um, what do we want to put it on? File folder or... Let's see if I have, yep, I think I have file folder right here. Yeah, so let's go ahead and just put that on a file folder. 
just to make it a wheezy bit stronger. And I think I want to put it on this side because I think that's where I got some coffee on there. So we'll just go ahead and glue that down. That way the whole thing will be just sturdier because you're not going to see the back of it. So um, Allergies are giving me a run for my money, so sorry for the sniffles. Here we go. Got that down. Just gonna grab. Thought I had. Thought I had one up there. Maybe not. But I have a backup. Kind of squish that down. And then we could cut her out. So let's go ahead and get this back in here before we close our glue up. Um, but yeah, it's supposed to be sunny today in the 80s, but I just looked at the weather. Well, that's so not straight. And it's going to be low humidity. So here in Georgia, it's not necessarily the... You know, temperature that gets you, it's the humidity. It's like so bad, pretty much all the time. So, I was glad to see it would be low humidity today. So, it should be pleasant. I think we're going to have a gentle breeze. There we go, guys. Yep, that's a lot sturdier. I like that. Okay, so gonna see yeah we got enough left in here we'll just go around those edges I'm not gonna do the back again because it is going to be glued to a page so there is one of course we could put a label and do more stuff on there you could even turn this into a tall tag you sure could all right so let's get that back down in there and let's make us another one. Okay. Let's see what picture. Kind of like to pick out the um, picture first. That's cute. You guys see all those butterflies? She's got hanging on her wall back here. How cute. Oh, look at the puppy. Or dog. That's a good one. Love that house back there. Let's use this one. Okay. Alright, so we got our picture. And we could probably go in and cut that down later. It's a little, little bit wide there. Let's see. It's not going to go that way. Of course, you could collage it, but... Let's see what we have. We have that piece. Yeah, let's go three inches on that. I like that. And these strips here, you can have them as skinny or, you know, as wide as you want them to be. Go ahead and give that a little distress. Again, just because mainly I distressed around the... Um, photos. Alright, so that can go there, and then maybe we can do our picture. And then what do we want at the top? Let's see. Something that is going to go with yellow. Let's see. Blue doesn't really go with yellow. don't know that I want another... Okay, let's see. That's not quite wide enough either. 
that one could be. But again, I'm just not sure if it really goes. There's some yellow. We could do that, perhaps. And then put something else there, maybe. Yep, that has words on it, so I kept that little piece. It says Philadelphia. Uh, Philadelphia, PA, USA. Oh, I bet we could do this. Nope, not quite long enough. I'm just going to stick these because I think this will be the last one we're going to do because I do have to go hop in the shower. Oh, this one would work. We could do this. Did that have? Nope, no yellow in that. Yeah, I think we could just do this three inches. Yeah, I think we'll do that. All right. We'll do three. Yeah, the end of this one doesn't like to cut good. It's kind of annoying, but... All right, where did my picture go? <coughs> Excuse me, did I stick it in here, guys? Oh, for heaven's sakes. There it is. Hiding way over there. It's going to go there, that's going to go there, and this will go here. Trying to see about how much maybe we want to cut off. If we don't do too much, then it's certainly going to give it some stability. There we go. Now, what I'm going to do, I think, I probably should have just left it. Let's just put this little strip here just to reinforce that. Because all of this right here is actually on cardstock. So, I think we'll do that. And then we'll throw the picture on top. edges over here because the rest of it will be covered up. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and use the art glitter glue. But yeah, I'm working 8 to 4 today off tomorrow. Um, next week, I will be working primarily night shifts. Um, so we've got some training and coaching that needs to happen. So we will be doing that. Make sure that everything is on the right track there. Um, so yeah, I think I'm only working like one day shift next week. that off just a tad then we'll go ahead and put this one in the middle again just for stu stability because you know that old photo is not there we go and then we can just do our photo there I'm thinking yeah I think so um, but yeah, primarily working at night, so 
Um, Angela and Veronica are back from their beach trip. They had a really good time, so um, Stephanie and Jaden stayed here with me and Papa. And Veronica's two were with their dad, so. And Jaden did really well. We were not sure. Um, he's the one with autism. So we weren't sure. He just loves being at home. Uh, and he only asked one time about, you know, when he would be going home. Look how dirty my mat was. It's disgusting. Lori, come on. Sorry about that, guys. Here we go. Okay. Alright, so I think we need that there where I cut that. And then, like I said, on these we could put labels or, you know, anything like that. On there, if we so choose, and we didn't even use these papers, which is fine. So, I am thinking, guys, let me put some of this stuff away. Oh, I'm sorry, guys, I hit you. It's no violence Wednesday, Lori. Um, put some of this stuff away real quick. Make sure the glue is topped off. And then, we will just take a quick peek at what we got done. And I will show you guys those other strips. So again, this was inspired by Gail over on her channel. I think they're pretty. And they could be used for belly bands or... Side to look at them in the little wagon. How cute is that? Super, super cute. Okay, so that's those. So that was actually our project for today. Now, let me show you what I have actually had ready, like, forever. Forever and a day. And haven't even did anything with it, which I really need to. So, I have these strips here. Um, so, I had just cut down some strips of file folder. And just have them bulldog clipped. And one collage snippet strip came from Satur Saturday's Sampler on Etsy, but I'm not sure if all of these are from there, but I just went ahead and cut those out, so we have those there, so you can use your file folder, but I also had these, and I think they were in a bundle marketplace haul that I did, these say it is a border punch strips, um, so these are all your you know, flashy colors and things there. And so there's that one. And then I had this one. This is actually textured paper. And then we have all of these colors here. I hope you guys can see that all right. Lots and lots of colors. And these are, what are these? One and a half? Nope, they're like two, two inches wide. And these are 2 by 12. So, yeah. So, both of those are 2 by 12. So, what I actually did was took the strip, this strip here, and I folded it. And it is folded at uh, 9 inches. And you can just put that over a page. And then I thought we could just take these strips and then just put it right down the middle you've got a belly band or you can do it like I said over the page um, you could collage behind this if you wanted to but I kind of like the um, textured paper um, so we may do some of these on video or I may just work on some of these and put them on my in my stash but like I said these are well this one's like almost 10 the way that I folded it down so that would work good in a tall skinny journal but those collage papers are really strips are really really cute um but yeah so if you come across these and look at there it looks like a fan anybody having a hot flash lord knows I have enough of them these days 
Yeah, look at all those colors. Aren't they so pretty? Yeah, make all kinds of things with those. All right, so there is that. So I need to get this done because, like I said, I know it has been in here probably a year and a half to two years or something similar. Really, really long time. I think I checked this. I don't think it fits. Nope, it doesn't fit. Um, but yeah, so I may do some of the skinnier ones. Same concept as these, but these, we are they're wider, of course. They're a different size. And we're cutting, you know, like collaging those. And this, the collaging is already done for you. Um, and I'm sure you can look for, like, collage strips uh, or something similar on Etsy. And find some of those. I'll just put those to the side. Um, because the next video I do, probably today, whenever I get home, will be my Roxy's uh, weekly challenge from Rachel um, from last week. So, yep. So, excited about doing that today. Also excited about getting my nails done tomorrow. They're too long. and they're, Oops, I'm sorry. Gosh, guys, I'm so sorry. I'm violent today, I guess. But I apologize. Uh, yeah, excited about getting my nails done today. I'm going to have them cut them just all the way off and all the way down because... They're actually irritating. All right, guys. Thank you all so much for joining me today. Uh, please give me a like if you came over just to check out my channel. I hope you will consider subscribing. Uh, also, leave me a comment. All of that helps my channel uh, with the algorithm. Al 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 is that what they call it? Anyway, whatever that rhythm is. I have no rhythm at all. So, you know, you don't want me dancing or singing. All right, guys, thank you all so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. I love these. Thanks a lot, Gail. And we will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.